people believe that uh, renewable energies would not be enough uh, to replace, to substitute um, atomic or fossil energies because it is told to them. And uh, the um, uh, big energy interests of today um, involved in uh, fossil and uh, atomic energy tell that and uh, people don't have enough mistrust. They don't know the distinction between uh, between um, between an economic interest and an expert, uh, an expert um, uh, who should uh, or would who would be or who should be neutral to the different energy sources, and uh, that uh, renewable energies would not be enough to replace conventional energies is an existential lie. It is an unbelievable lie. It is totally wrong. Uh, it is very often um, described, it was very often described that and how there could be a general um, shift to uh, renewable energies. But um, the um, uh, experts of the conventional energy system and all the scientists who are on their payroll uh, ignore that uh, in a, ignore that intentionally, and uh, because if they would accept, if they would agree that a total um, shift to renewable energies would be possible, uh, let's say in the run of the next twenty-five or thirty years and it is possible in such a time, um, they would lose totally their legitimation to continue nuclear and fossil energy investments. Uh, this is um, the main reason. Uh, the um, conventional energy companies will be the losers, will become the losers of the change to renewable energies, and that's the reason why they resist.